Hey everybody, it's your favorite host, Tiffany Dunn of the Wicked Edge on TTM Wicked Radio. And I am at Paley History Con 2 at Lake George, New York at Fort William Henry. And I am sitting with Dad Celeb Bob McGillivray. Hi, baby. How are you doing? Good. Yeah, how are you? Thanks for having me. Thanks. Hey, it's our pleasure and our honor. Thank you so much. Oh, you missed me. Did you have a good time? Oh, I'm having a blast. I wish it was all like all week. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I made a lot of new friends, a lot of new connections, so I'm enjoying myself. So, first, how did you get involved with that? Basically, I owned a structure company for 11 years, and I've had a fascination with paranormal for longer than that, and I put the two passions together and uh, created the web series, uh, which led to the TV series. So, very fortunate to have gotten that part of that class. Now, do you have other projects in the West? I do, I do. I have, uh, can't give a lot of details, but I have another paranormal pilot that we shot for another show. Also, a very cool book. I've never done before, it's hard to say. Um, I've done documentary films, and some photo books, and I've done pretty much anything with production. Awesome. Now, I'm just saying, Thank you. Thank you. Now, you're going to be shooting the Wicked Edge on TV Show. shows are people that are comfortable with it, you know, people that are comfortable going into a haunted prison or a haunted home and facing whatever is there. It occurred to me that what would happen if you took someone who didn't want to be a West Virginia State penitentiary or didn't want to go into this home and see if you get any different response at different levels of activity based on their fear. And we got some very interesting results doing that. So, Bust the name ghost bait. We basically use individuals that don't really want to be there as bait for ghosts. And uh, we've got a proven track record of that being a very successful way to investigate. What was one of their most intense experiences where you maybe weren't so sure this was a good idea? Sure. Um, we did uh, one in particular where we set up uh, one of our own team members, William, who was very, very scared of everything, including his own shadow. And we made a video of a ballroom at a location we were at. So we filmed all the symbols were, we filmed the room, and we put a bag on the sock on his head. So he didn't worry about us for eight hours in the car. We drove him there, sat him on the floor with the symbols in the room with these rituals allegedly out in front him. The alarm goes off on the iPad, takes the bag off his head, presses play on the video, and this video was terrifying. We you know, made it a little more dramatic, if you will. And the scene with the wall that's behind him in there, shot before. As a matter of fact, though, if you turn around and look, you're sitting at the exact site where the rituals occurred. He turns around and sees what he just watched behind him, not knowing where he was for the last eight hours, and freaked out. So, uh, we weren't so sure. I wasn't so sure he was going to kill me at that point. <laughs> it was definitely an interesting investigation. That's so cool. I, I did not see that stuff until I had to. Sure. Absolutely. Uh, awesome. Where, um, where can people see your show? Where sure. can they find you? Um, they can find, it's a little confusing, the web series. Uh, if you go to Uh we sell the DVDs with all six uh, episodes of the web series, plus a third disc that has it's literally filled to the brim with behind the scenes, outtakes, a lot of fun stuff. We're not afraid to show what goes on the end. show is not really uh, If they want to see the TV version, which is on the bio channel, uh, that's available on iTunes and it's available on Amazon. Just search for Ghost Day. And with all the other stuff I talked about, um, if people want to reach out and send me a friend request at uh, facebook.com slash mcgill.bob, M-A-G-I-L-L. Everything I do, I post on there, whether it's an investigation, whether it's production, whether it's you know out in L.A. just doing the networking thing. It's on there, so you can find out more there. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for coming. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. And so, everybody, this is Bob McGill of Ghost Space. He has some of his own production company. Don't forget to look up his show. And um, everybody have a great time and keep tuning in because we're going to keep doing these videos. We might run into him again. You never know. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, everybody. Good night. I appreciate it. Oh, honey, anytime. Hold on a second.